Election officials are doing a recount on the millage proposal to support Hillsborough County schools. That process started this morning. ABC Action News reporter Mary O'Connell explains how it works and what happens next. A recount is underway right now as machines work to count the votes in the millage referendum to support Hillsborough County schools. In a nearly split decision, it's not over yet. We're in the process now of we're going to rescan uh, 228,800 and some ballots over the next hopefully 18 hours that we'll be doing this. And then we'll have our second set of uh, unofficial results. The Hillsborough County Canvassing Board ordered a machine recount in the millage referendum. The latest unofficial totals show the no's are still leading by 591 votes. It's at 0.26%. So we could very well be in a manual recount. After a machine recount, a manual recount will happen. If the second set of unofficial results shows a candidate or issue lost by 0.25% or less of the votes cast. Hillsborough County Supervisor of Elections Craig Latimer explained what's going on behind the scenes. Officials are running the ballots through and he says the machines are kicking out overvotes and undervotes. He said an overvote is when someone voted for too many people in a race, while an undervote is when they didn't vote for anybody in that race. The machine will kick those out. We will keep those separated because if we go to a manual recount, that's what we're looking at. Uh, we're actually going to physically look at each one of those 24 or 27,000 ballots to make sure that there wasn't any voter intent uh, that they intended to vote for a candidate or yes or no on the referenda item. The one mill referendum is a proposed property tax increase and meant to increase salaries to retain and recruit teachers and staff, as well as expand art, music and PE. While this plays out, district leaders told us earlier this week how they're looking ahead. We go back to work. We continue to be champions for our teachers, champions for our support staff, champions for our school based leaders and district leaders, and most importantly, champions for students. In Hillsborough County, Mary O'Connell, ABC Action News. And this is a topic we've been covering for a while, while now. You can check out all of our in-depth reporting, breaking down everything you need to know about this referendum right now here on ABCActionNews.com. And once we have the final results of this recount, we will share that with you on air and online. Just make sure to download the ABC Action News mobile app so you can get updates sent straight to your phone.